Welcome to UNV Academy. In this episode, we are going to talk about camera management of NVR. We will tell you how to add cameras in four ways and delete cameras. Let's get started. First, let's log into the system. Click Menu. Before we are going to add any IP camera to the NVR, we need to make sure that the camera and NVR are on the same network. Then we'll be able to add these devices. As this E2 NVR supports 8 channels, so we can add up to 8 IP cameras to it. For this PoE NVR, we can only manually configure the camera info to add camera. Choose D1. Camera configuration. We can see this modify IP camera interface. And all the camera on the same network will be shown here. There are four ways to add cameras, including IP address, plug and play, easy DDNS and domain name. We will introduce them one by one. Number one, add by IP address. For protocol, we have three choices. Onvif, Uniview and Custom. UNV cameras support all these protocols. If you are going to add a UNV camera, you are free to choose any protocol. But if you are going to add a third-party camera, please select on VIF. And if your third-party camera also supports RTSP, custom can be selected as well. Here we are going to add a UNV camera, so any of them will work. Click device on the same network. We will directly get IP address. Enter the username and password. Click extended transmission if you need to transmit for a long distance. This process will take a few seconds. You can click refresh to get the status of camera. Now the camera is online. In the same way, we can add more devices. Number two, add by plug and play mode. As previously mentioned that this is a PoE NVR. So if your camera supports PoE function too, you can connect the IPC with NVR by a network cable. If the camera has a default password or has been added to the same channel before, once the IPC is connected to the network port, it will get online automatically. Click OK and refresh it. We can find the camera online now. Sometimes the password has been changed. In that case, we need to enter the password. Number three, add by easy DDNS. We need to configure on web interface of the IPC. Then turn to modify IP camera interface, select the protocol and enter the obtained server address, domain name, username and password. Click OK to complete the adding. Number 4 Add by Domain Name We need to configure on the IPC web interface. Then turn to Modify IP Camera Interface. Select the protocol. Enter the domain name username and password applied for by the domain name website. The port is the external port of the IPC. Click OK to complete the adding. OK, here are four ways to add IP cameras and make them online. But if we want to make it offline, we can enter a wrong password or a different IP address. In the status, we can see the offline reason is incorrect username or password. One more tip to mention. For NVR with non-PoE channels, there is a delete button to delete device directly. That's all for today's learning. Hope this will be helpful to you. Thanks for your watching. See you next time.